percent combo because he got in like six Spitfires. That's insane. What I just saw was criminal. Rewind. You're the MVP right now. Damn, that looked hot. All right. There's one way Kinetic Balding can redeem himself. By facing the master himself. Kinetic Balding's going to hate my guts after this. I've given him like three top players and th three top characters. Doesn't it only stack to three? Yeah, but the problem is, I think... Wait, where did his health go? Yeah, exactly. Do you guys want to see a replay of that? Press one if you want to see a replay of that. I got it queued up. Because I'm, I'm like watching that baby all night tonight. Here. I wouldn't be surprised if Kinetic Balding doesn't come back. I think that might have made him quit. I'd... I'd consider it. All right, here we go. Here we go. I've got to see a replay of this. I want to see a replay. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm running out of monitor space. Shit. Hold on. Let's see. Uh, yeah, that'll work. Sorry. It's not the perfect, but just deal with me, guys. This. You play this. You play this. You play that. I didn't do that tonight. These guys can actually play whoever they want, except Kinetic Balding. Kinetic Balding and Relaxed State, they have to play Cyborg. Because they're like Cyborg's last greatest hope. Oh my god. Clip that. Oh my god. Clip that. Superman. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> it's so much damage. <laughs> Dude, it's so much damage. Begin. That hey, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. That is the most that is the dumbest fucking thing I've ever seen in this game. <laughs> Why am I playing Dr. Fate when I could just do that? That is awesome. Rewind, you rewind. Dude, I love you for showing me that. I love you. <laughs> I don't care if you're weirded by that. Yeah, dude, he got six. I think he got six flame spits. All right, so this is a uh, Emperor Theo. Back to this match: Emperor Theo versus Kinetic Balding. You know, this matchup, in my opinion, at the highest level, was probably six-four Cyborg. I think this was 6-4 Cyborg in Injustice 1 because of this right here. If you can do crispy bacon anti-airs anti all day and night, like, I, but Meter Burn Roll could change a lot because basically what he just did, he couldn't do it in Injustice 1, so that could change a lot of things. But even if he trades laser, I mean, I think Cyborg wins the damage. Wins the meter building, wins the chip building. I mean, Theo literally won that round because of one interactable and... And meter burn roll, which he'll probably do again in a second. Actually, he's not going to do meter burn roll with that, that amount of health deficit. After re rewind, after seeing what you just did on that combo, it's made me, it's made me rethink life, and I'm going to fully optimize my Atrocitus even more now. I'm already fully optimizing him, but after that, there's no question. All it takes, man, is one super. I actually crossed up. All it takes is one Superman to get in one time, and it's a long day. Poor Cyborg. That combo rewind did was the Madsen thing I couldn't remember. Oh, thanks, Foxy. Thanks, Foxy. Hey, l let me. L can I tell you guys real quick how good of a friend Foxy is? Within five minutes, I see my European brother. He's sitting next to me. He's like, "Yo, I pay yo mess and got." I can't. I can't do. The, I can't do the Foxy impersonation. Now. I don't know why. Superman. Like Grid. Foxy, I'm, a, I'm Foxy. Madsen got this broke tech. He not gonna tell you how to do it. I forgot how to do it. I can't show you how to do it. That's basically what he said. More or less. Translation. Too bad Madsen couldn't make Combo Breaker because he has some broken ass tech with Atrocis. But I don't want to tell you what it is because he'll be mad if I told you what it is. I'm not, I'm not for a second going to tell you what it is. Yeah, that's why I said Tom. Man. 
Oh, Viking Viking said rewind and steal it. I taught it to him. Why alright, I got a question. Why doesn't Viking talk to why doesn't Viking talk to me? Why doesn't Madsen talk to me? Why doesn't Foxy tell me what Madsen tells him? Is there like this hidden agenda against showing me things? Hey, what's up, Dragon? Alright, so well well Viking, as far as I'm concerned, Rewind came up with it. You didn't show me shit. Actually, everything that Viking has come up with, I've had other people tell me what Viking has come up with, like third hand. No more Mr. Boy Scout. Like, there's two things people have shown me Viking came up with that Viking didn't bother to share with uh, the Atrocitus community or any of us that, that he knows plays Atrocitus. But, you know, third parties, like like through the grapevine, people will tell me, hey man, let me show you what. Let me show you this broken ass shit that uh, Viking came up with the other day. It's uh, <sighs> yeah, man, it's really, uh, it's really broken, man. I gotta, I gotta show it to you. It's basically what my past two weeks has been like. Oh, rewind, rewind, tag me next time, dude. Next time I find some broke shit, and by the way, I've been finding a lot of great shit with Fate. I'm not gonna show any of you people. What do you mean? You people? Oh, oh. One meter and roll, that's all it takes. I would just do four, three, four, three, yep. Oh, oh, I got him in the corner. Cyborg, Cyborg on the street. Apparently has broke ass damage in the corner. Oh, why, why don't you do bounce cancel? If I did bounce cancel, he would have won. Find some, oh, uh, that's it. Smart to do that combo, not to let him clash. Superman wins. What's Pig gonna show you? What? What are you talking about, Tweety? Tweety, what's Pig gonna show you? Is Tweety here? Superman. Grid. Pig's gonna show me the goods. I'll show Tweety whatever he wants. Fighters are approaching Metropolis. To be honest, Balding had that match. He just didn't do a bounce cancel to end it. Tom, do you want to play tonight? Begin. People, people would love to see Thomas Brady. We may get some Captain Cold. I know Buffalo, Buffalo uh, told me that he wants to play tonight, so I might get Captain Cold on here as well. Do you guys think Captain Cold is a pure build and a low-tier hero? Or do you think people are going to find some broken stuff with him that's actually going to make him really good? Tom Brady versus Kinect Balding would be really good. I agree. Cold is 100% a bill. Okay. Yeah, no problem, Ruko. I try to read as much as uh, as much stuff in the chat as I can. If I don't respond to you, don't take offense to it. It's just there's a lot of chat going on, and I try to do as much as I can. You've learned something. All right, Elite. I see you. I have this. I have this list of matches that I'm trying to go in order. We're not ending anytime soon, so everyone relax and just kind of enjoy the ride tonight. Oh shit, drop my controller again. Oh, it's on the floor. We're not doing that bad on time, actually. Superman wins. Quite honestly, I think Scarecrow is, in fact, one of those characters that will develop positively over time. I strongly, strongly, strongly feel that, uh, Cy uh, not Cyborg, Scarecrow is one of those characters that will definitely heavily develop. All right, Kinetic Balding has left 3-0. All right, Kinetic Balding is going to be really upset with me. I gave him three hard matchups in a row. But I gave him these three hard matches because I thought he would actually, you know, it's hyper if he wins one of those or does, you know, just put Cyborg on the map with one of these. Um... All right, let me do the next match. Uh, hold on. Oops, no, not you. I don't know who you are. No, don't invite that person. Who is that? Who did I just invite? No. Here, let me get the next match up. 